The tornado that hit Hopkinsville left a trail of destruction. News Channel 5's Olivia Michael introduces us to a husband and wife who were in the middle of the storm's path and say it was a split second decision that kept them alive. Not even the gentle sound of church bells or a dusting of snow could hide the destruction in Hopkinsville. We're kind of staying kind of close together these days. This is the gas station where Mark and Sherry Jones were fueling up just a day ago. So I come up to go around the pump here to talk to her and then I just out of the corner of my eye see something. Oh my God. That something was an EF2 tornado barreling straight at them. However fast old people can run over there yes. is how fast we ran. The Joneses say it took just seconds for the tornado to reach where they had been standing. Just take a look at this gas pump that was ripped from the ground and fell where Sherry had been pumping gas moments before it happened. And so we ran uh, over here and I just said, we got to get down, we got to get down. The auto zone next door became the couple's shelter. My head was down here and up I was that way. Yeah, up here and I was facing, I was facing the wall, trying to not be up that way. Yeah. And he was over me, you know, keeping anything from hitting me. In just a minute, the tornado destroyed several businesses, taking down power lines and forever leaving an impact. And it was the only time ever in my life, probably hers too, that you really wonder, or I ever wondered if I was gonna make it. Yeah, I mean, I wasn't sure. It was the first day of 2022 that no one could have imagined, but the Joneses aren't disappointed. Somebody said, you know, it's New Year's Day, what bad luck. Well, not from our perspective, you know, <laughs> this and that, we get new vehicles, yes. but we can't, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, we're, we feel very fortunate. Yeah, for sure. In Hopkinsville, Olivia Michael, News Channel 5. Glad they are open.